I'm sorry. The theme is just that catchy. Hello everyone, my name is Jasirium, and I bid you all a warm welcome back to Let's Play Crash Bandicoot War, the Insane Trilogy Edition. In the last episode, we did a little bit of collecting of gems in Ski Crazed, finishing off Hang 'em High, and getting the gems and relic on Area 51. And in this episode, we are going to finish off the secret war room, starting with collecting the two gems we couldn't get on Future Frenzy because we missed a couple boxes. So, yeah. This level requires a lot of backtracking because there are boxes in the secret gem room. So yes, now we can get both gems in this general area because we couldn't get it earlier because, well, the boxes were hidden in this route specifically. All right, so first and foremost, destroy the boxes and destroy the minion in the flying saucer so we don't endure that whole nonsense. Okay. Alright, let's not fall off. Because that would be very unwise. Alright, so... Get all the nitros. And spin that. Destroy that drone, destroy those boxes, avoid the laser. Alright, shoot all those boxes. Wait for those to come back. Boom, boom, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright, and... Damn it. All right, come here, you two. Okay, whatever. Hey, how come you didn't get blown up? All right, so we're almost there anyway, so... Get rid of those nitros. Wait for those two platforms to come back. Boom, boom, grab that. And now... Some backtracking. Of course, it takes me all the way over here. Alright. Now, to do the backtracking... You go away. Alright, so... Oh no, no spikies for you. Alright, get rid of you. Grab the Aku Aku mask. Or whatever you want to call it. Aku Aku. The Ooga Booga Man. The Ooga Gong. What have you. Alright, so, let's go on this platform, and go all the way back to the beginning. Alright, so first, wait for the laser to go away. Whoa, shit. Okay, so, destroy these. Boom. 
destroy those. Wait for those to go away. Go away. Whoa, okay. Nearly spun myself into that nitro. Didn't want to do that. Alright. Do, 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 do. Alright, so jump on that TNT, maintain a bit of distance. Destroy those. Destroy those. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Alright. Now we just have to make our way back without dying. Go away. Alright, and back we go. I mean, if I wanted to, and if we have enough time, I can grab the last couple of gems from Dynamite and and the Bug Light thing. Alright, so we're back where we were. You go away. Hit the checkpoint. You go away. You go away. Alright, wait for that to come back. Don't you flip back over. Oh, it flips back over after a bit of time. Okay. That's fine. Alright, wait. Wait. Go! Blow those up. Right! Gotta go on to this little area here. Do 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 Dang it, I lost my Aku Aku! It's fine. Dying here does not count as losing a life, so we're good. I missed that one, fortunately. You see? I mean, I could have done that spinny tornado thing, the death tornado spin, all the way back, but that would have been too risky because that would have been over a pit and I didn't have enough time to go over the pit again, so. Fortunately, since we have the bazooka, that makes things a little easier. Alright. 127 of 133. Not bad, not bad. You go away. 
Oh crap. Nearly fell into the pit! No! Not into the pit! It burns! Alright. Wha-bam! Wha-bam! And... There we have it! The two gems of Future Frenzy. Huzzah! To celebrate, let's let Crash do his little dance. All right, on to the next one. On to level 30, Rings of Power. Oh boy! Here we go. This is going to be a little bit difficult. Why? Because we have many things to worry about. We have to fly through 30 rings in order. We have to beat Cortex's minions flying about. And if we miss if we miss just one Yeah. Basically, you miss a ring, you have to go back. The game will not let you proceed unless you get through the ring. So you either fly through all the rings, or you either fly through all the rings, or you or you fail. Like, see, see, if you don't fly through the ring before that fourth one, going through that fourth one will not count. Dang it! So, yeah. We have... So, yeah. We basically have to race Cortex's minions through 30 rings, and we cannot miss one of them. We miss any, we cannot go to the finish line. Damn it! <sighs> and getting the box gem on this one, I mean, it may seem easy, but at the same time, it's not easy. Because if you're wanting to go for the box gem, you're gonna have to go at a snail's pace. Unless you're somehow a beast at getting through this stage. Okay, you know what? Fuck the rings. I'm gonna get the... Hold on a moment. Sorry, dogs were being a pest. Where was I? Oh, right. So, yeah. If you're wanting to get the... The race gem and the and the crate gem at the same time. That's going to be easier said than done. So go. So yeah, go for the race gem first. Alright, so you have to go through 30 of these rings. You cannot miss one. Otherwise, 
wise. Otherwise, that's it. <laughs> the unfortunate thing about this being a race and all is that The unfortunate thing about this being a race and all is that, you know how in the previous plane levels you can basically shoot down Cortex's minions so they don't shoot at you? Yeah. Here, because this is a race, you can shoot at them, but it will only slow them down. I'm going for the... I'm going for the box gem first. I don't give a shit if I'm missing rings. I'm going for the box gem first. Like, how are you supposed to catch up to them? I mean, it's like orange asphalt, but in the air. by that is they are far ahead of you that you cannot reach them unless you somehow master unless you somehow master the stage gonna happen. Those minions are pretty much gone anyway. So I'm on my lonesome. Oh, no wait, they're still around. 
They're just rubbing it in that I lost. Um, what? How am I in second place? Like, how am I in first? What the fuck is going on? Um, what? Third? Uh, game, will you make up your mind? Hello? Oh, now you're telling me I'm in fourth. Yeah, I know, I lost. You don't have to rub it in. What the? Um. Hello? Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 I know. Alright, so I got the gem on that. Well, the crate gem, anyway. Now I just gotta win the race. Which is easier said than done. Because that would require me to do a whole lot of barrel rolling, or whatever you want to call it. That's right. In order to stand a look of a chance against these fuckers, you have to channel your inner Star Fox. And if you're like me and you haven't played a single Star Fox game in your life, not once, that's That's basically going to be easier said than done. However, if you manage to pull it off, well, you manage to pull it off. God damn it! That's the problem with trying to barrel roll through those rings and trying to maintain a certain speed. Because after you. After you. After you do a barrel roll through these, your maximum speed increases, which will make it harder to turn around and by turn around I mean just it'll make steering harder yeah it's very hard to steer when you're going fast that's why that's why I do not that's why I will not defend this level. This is not a very good level. Well, in my eyes. I mean, if you're a master at the airplane stages, then you might like this level. This, however, if you're going through the game normally, this is not a good level.
Damn it! Maybe if I aim in the center of the thing, I should be able to get through the ring. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna rely on the reticle. I say as I pass the ring! This is one of the couple levels I've been dreading ever since doing this Let's Play. Just this level here. Did I mention that this is not a very good level? This is not a very good level! I mean, if you like airplane levels in the- I mean, if you like the airplane levels in this game, fine. You do you, but in my opinion, this is not a very good level. For that reason, once you go through a ring, you have a speed boost, which makes it almost impossible to steer to get through that other ring safely without slowing down. In today's episode of Crash Bandicoot Warped, the Insane Trilogy Edition, flying! And that's it. Just flying. Nope. 
no, 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 not today. Like, look at this. They're way too ahead of me for me to catch up. Oh my fucking god! Why? Every time I try to go, every time just you go through a ring, you speed up, you have zero control over steering. Unless you're very good at the airplane levels in this game. I've said it before, I'll say it again. This is not a good level. Okay, so we're in second place now, but I don't know how long that will last. I mean, if I miss a ring, I have to fly back. And if I fly back, these minions will pass me, and I do not want to run that risk. For that reason! I was so close to winning! If that guy didn't fly so far ahead of me, and I missed... And if I didn't miss that ring, I would have won. But no! Murphy's Law just had the strike! Damn it! Ugh. God. Screw you, disfavor! Okay, you slow down. I would very much appreciate it if you just slow down there, buddy, and let me go ahead. No! So close! So fucking close! Damn it! Why? Why do you fly so low? Ugh. Ugh. If the race portion of this is this annoying, I dread going through the time trial of this. God 
damn it! <sighs> if if the race portion of this is bad, I dread going through the time trial. Slow down, you bastard! Fucking time! designed to piss people like me off. Okay, note to self. If you want to get through the rings of this level, don't barrel roll too much. Only barrel roll when you need to. Oh my god. Oh my god. I swear after... I swear after I'm through with this game, I am never touching it again. show off the bonus levels, I am 
I am never touching this game again. I get the gem? Please tell me I got the gem. I swear to God if I didn't get the gem. Good! Fuck rings of power! Ugh. Now the horror of time and trial on this, it begins. So we're going to do the time trial on this and then save the remaining collection of gems for the next episode because fuck this level. Fuck this level and everything it stands for.
And I missed it! How did I miss? Damn it. Ugh. Again, levels like this were not designed for time trial. good level to do time trial. Again! I swear, if I keep missing that ring, I'm I'm going to break something. No, 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 absolutely not. You will not, you will stay away from me.
this is not a good level. Have I said that before? Oh, I have? Oh, I didn't realize that. One more thing, though. This is not a good level. Evil! travel powers, just being able to meet, being able to meet favorite childhood icons, seeing historical events unfold before my eyes, just to name a few. But one of the few things on the time travel bucket list, if, if I ever have the ability of time travel, is Going back to the time of the development of the original Crash Bandicoot War. Going to Naughty Dog and asking whose idea was it for an aerial ring race? Because this is not a good level! I know, I sound like a broken record, but seriously, this level is not good. It is not good at all. Okay, that was close. If that reticle was outside the barrier, that would not have been good at all. Down, you bastard! God damn it! This level is fucking rubbish!
minions listen. This is how it's going to go down. You are going to let me get through this time trial. Whatever the goal time is, you are going to let me get this. And then once I get the gold, I am never touching this goddamn level again. done with this level. Depending on how long this level takes, if I don't get gold on this, I'll get the gold off camera and then continue with the remaining gems and possibly the finale in the next episode or two, depending on how long it takes to get the gems. Oh no, you don't!
nope, 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 nope. You come back here. No, 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 no. Aha! No, 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 no. No, you, you get behind me. You get behind me. Good boy. Finally! God! Fuck! This level! Finally! God! That frickin' minion! Alright, and with that, I think that's all the gold relics here. So, let's just save our progress. Alright, let's see. We got 27 gold, 1 platinum. Oh, don't tell me we have to get the... Don't tell me we have to go to level 31 to get the remaining... Please don't tell me we have to... Because, if I recall correctly, in the original version of the game, you didn't necessarily have to go through this one, but this... This level, Future Tense, it's exclusive to... It's exclusive to the Insane Trilogy. Do I have to get the gems there to get the final boss, or... Is... I'm... I'm so confused. I mean, we're... Right! Alright, there's that gem. What other gems am I missing? Alright, so there's that one. Got everything on that one. Got everything on that one. Alright, so it's that one. Got everything here. Don't mind me just double checking things. Got everything there. Alright, so it's. Got that. Right! Box gems on dynamite. Okay, so that's gonna do it for this episode. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.